Can you spot the differences between the two browser windows on screen? The scratch window on the right has a backpack, but the left one does not. Find out why next. On this YouTube channel, I make coding tutorial videos just like this one, so if you're new here, please consider subscribing to help the channel out. The reason why the Scratch window on the left doesn't have a backpack is because I'm not logged into Scratch in the left browser window. On the right, however, you can see that I'm logged in, so I have access to the backpack. Imagine you worked for Nintendo back in the early 1980s, and you were tasked with creating the Mario sprite for a game called Super Mario Bros. You would have had to figure out what the sprite should look like, how he should jump, walk, and run. You would have also needed to create various costumes to create the animations for all of these moves, including when to make the sprite bigger, like when he picks up a mushroom. Maybe a few years later, you get asked to make Mario again for Super Mario Bros. 2. And you could spend all that time recreating the sprite and its functionality, or what's more likely is you would have brought in everything you created in the first game into the second game, and then made small changes. In Scratch, you may encounter a situation that you've already solved, or maybe you created some functionality in one project that could work in a new project. The reason the backpack is useful is because it allows you to transfer costumes, sprites, sounds, and scripts from one project into another. On screen, I've created a script that allows my character to jump up and come back down in this project called Jump Around. Now it took me a little while to figure out how to simulate gravity, so if I were to do another project in the future, I don't really want to have to figure it out all over again. I could open up this project and bring in this script by using my backpack. To do that, I can click on the backpack down at the bottom and you'll notice that my backpack is empty. Now I could drag in the sprite, or I can bring in the script that I want to carry over to another project. And now you'll see that this script, this code, is in my backpack. So if I was to start a new project by going to File, New, I can actually bring this script from my first project into this new sprite in my new project. And when I press the space key, you'll notice that the bear also jumps. But maybe you imported some costumes for a sprite and you want to bring the entire sprite into another project. That's also doable. So for example, I can click on this bear and drag it into my backpack and go back to my first project and pull it out. Just as if I was bringing Mario from Super Mario World 1 into Super Mario World 2. You can do that using the backpack. The backpack allows you to save time by quickly allowing you to bring parts of your projects into other projects. If you found this video to be helpful, I'd appreciate it if you hit the thumbs up button, and I'll see you next time.